Are All we right. talking about the Diddler today? Again? I don't know. Are we talking about Drake Future? Well, first we're going to... K-Dot, J. Cole, Before Metro? we get things started, we're going to talk on uh, one of my favorite ever in the NFL. I used to watch him all the time when I was a youngster. Bro, you straight capping, man. You know what I'm saying? You straight capping. Watched him at a day. How? <laughs> you wasn't even born when you was playing, bro. You know what I'm saying? OJ Simpson, rest in peace to OJ. Rest you know? in peace to, to the legend. Rest in peace to the legend. Rest in peace to OJ. But how so. you gonna label him as your greatest, one of your greatest players all time uh, ever? Man, he broke the all time season record, two thousand wow. yards, nineteen seventy three. 2,003 yards If y'all niggas Want to be exact I just want to let y'all know you This know nigga I mean? is reading Off the screen the Russian title So You know what I'm saying <laughs> We not gonna get up title, here 1972 yeah. 1973 like sports right. analyst He's reading mm-hmm. Off a screen I'm letting right, y'all know right. this now 23 touchdowns yeah. In 75 mm-hmm. Nah he probably know What he's talking about mm-hmm. though But Mm-hmm. Six Pro Bowl. I don't know if you labeling him as your greatest player all the yeah, time because yeah, yeah. he nah, wasn't I even was playing joking. during your season. I just see like a Barry Sanders, a Emmitt Smith. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And if you say one of those, yeah, nah, talking like, about right, 75. Cool. He wasn't even around. Yeah, yeah. but um, first and foremost, you know, condolences to the family. Yeah, condolences. on both that. sides. You know what I'm yeah, saying? And all of that, a polarizing figure he is. I yeah, mean, especially from because honestly, what I mostly know him from is from the OJ case back in uh in '94, yeah, yeah. like that. And I hated that case. I hated yeah. it. That's when my brother Junie just came home from college, Brown University. He went there for law, so he was an entertainment lawyer. And every day he would come home. And watch the damn... He, actually, he didn't... Because he wasn't even working full-time then, or whatever lawyers do. Every day, he would wake up and turn on the OJ trial from, like, 8 in the morning to whenever it stopped. That was everybody. For almost a oh, year. Yeah. That was everybody. That was, was everybody. That was the first reality series. I hated it, though. I was 12 in 1994. Yeah, you probably wasn't even interested. I, w- I was about to I say that. I wasn't interested at, at all. Yeah, but that so was... So how could you hate it if yeah, you're not interested? Because that was, he was taking up the TV the whole day. That was the whole world. I mean, those were just the major news channels. We only though, had man. one TV in the crib but just think and he about took it. over that tv oh, you know how important that was so that especially back in the day we got devices now that didn't have nothing to do with oj though so yeah but wait yeah, think he, about he it yeah i'm about to say that's that. what you talk yeah, yeah he took the tv so <laughs> by way of the tv that's the root of the hurt that's the root of the hurt that's the nah, root nah, of the nah, hurt nah, get to the yeah. root. at the end of the day the root is you supposed to be in school while this anyway, trial is on now actually not you know what i'm saying Monday going to school. about four or five o'clock. And you should have been in school. Yeah. So you think I was cutting eighty two? Yeah, do your. I know you was cutting eighty two. I know you was cutting eighty two. Cutting JHS 82? You was cutting 82. All the time? No. I, I didn't really start cutting until I got to high school. You banned her? Yeah. Because mm. that's when that's when you know the security guard. That's when streets was like, yo, you know we could just leave, right? And I was like, no, we can't. And he was like, we could just walk streets. out. The guards won't chase us or nothing. Cause you know in junior high school they used to have the wait streets. That's you know. that's yeah. West. Yeah. Wow, I forgot guys his name. Shout out to you, West. Yeah, man. shout out to West. My bad, my yeah, bad. Man. I forgot that. Yo, that's yeah, crazy. Yeah, polarizing figure, man. Um, polarizing figure. Um, yeah, it's, back it's, on it's track. Still, it, it's still interesting though, even after all of these years, how when you mentioned it, I we talked about it briefly in corporate the other day at, at the Gizo, mm-hmm. and. uh I could just see, as soon as the name was mentioned, the temperature changed. Oh, yeah. You know, everybody got the same alert the same time. Me and uh, the homegirl got it. And we was like, yo, OJ passed. But then when that came out, nobody said nothing. And it got quiet in the mm-hmm. office. So it's st- he's still a polarizing figure. Man, I'm asking a question. We know Diddy did it. Did OJ do it? Mm. You know what? And we're not going off of just the trial response because we know the trials, they acquitted him and said right. it wasn't him. Right. So right. No, we technically about he did opinion. it, but do you really think he did it or not? Now I now I think he did it. Over time, I started I started to see his mannerisms and then he did that old uh, documentary, uh, the book called If I Did Do It, mm-hmm. where he actually kind of telling all the pieces of the story, really. I don't mm-hmm. know if y'all ever saw that. I heard, I heard about it. It's, it's, it's interesting. Um, I but, don't think he did it. But be real. he he don't seem like to me, and this is the last piece. F- he don't seem like um, <laughs> when he talk about it. He don't seem like he's a kind of a person, or he don't give off that feeling like he's uh, remorseful about it at all. 
he almost talked about it in a joking way. So if he didn't do it, he would always say, I ain't do it. He's almost like mocking it, basically. Yeah, what you're saying. yeah. so that's what kind of gave it away to me. But, you know, we oh. was all cheering for it because that was, for us, it was just like, okay, a black man gets, a, you know what I'm saying, we get we get a point off of that because they've been doing this wrong and man, all I these hate years. to say this, but you're wrong. I think around the time yeah, that, it's I think around the time that the trial was actually happening, they said, like, what was that, um, the Rodney King joint was like yeah, had was just really days. like died down. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. I want to say like black Americans needed a victory there, but was it a real victory? I don't know. Yeah. Um, I was actually talking to somebody in the Walmart, right? And he just ran down on me, like literally. So older white man. He's like, you know, OJ, da da da. This is before he passed away. And we was talking, he was like, and I'm wondering to myself, I'm thinking like, why would you bring up OJ to me? Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I'm a black man, you're a white man, da, da, da. So I didn't really want to play the race card. But then we got to talk and then I walked away, right? But then I'm like, did he really do it? Mm-hmm. And then I just started thinking about the motions that some dudes could actually have with females. And I don't know if I'm 100% right. Yeah. So don't hold my word as bond. Right. You see what I'm saying? Right. But the nigga could have probably been dealing with two chicks at the same time, meaning the one that passed away and the side piece. Yeah. And a lot of niggas get emotional with their side piece. Then they want to leave their main bitch. Yeah. But then the side piece would be like, nigga, fuck you. I don't yeah. want you yeah. no more. I got another nigga. Yeah. So yeah. he could have went like literally ape shit. And I'm not taking nothing away from him and his passing. And I'm not trying to make joke of it, but I'm, nah, I'm but talking about shit that seriously mm-hmm. could happen. Yeah. Like, he could have probably went crazy snap, went to go apologize to his wife, and then saw her with another nigga, and then just snap. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. Yeah. But pussy is a hell of a drug is what I'm going to say. It it is. So you never know what happened. Is he capable of doing it? Yeah. I mean, if we look at that scenario. Anybody's capable of doing it. Anybody's capable of doing that. Did OJ do it? I'm going to go out on the limb and I'm going to say, no, he didn't do it. I saw a documentary, don't remember the name of it, but I saw a documentary some odd years ago about what actually happened in the case and about how, you know, certain things were happening in the case where they were proven on a day-to-day basis reasons why he didn't do it. But what was being broadcasted on the news, it made it look like the actual, um, the, the, what do you call that? The prosecutors were winning. You know what mm. I'm saying? So I think OJ didn't do it. Going out on a limb and I'm standing I mean, legally, he didn't do it. He wasn't guilty. So that's what I would say to people that get like... In real life. That, yeah, in real did. life right now that get like... Um, that get mad about the whole thing and and mm-hmm. try to and really try to shit on his name that he passed, now that he passed. Your legal system didn't find him guilty. So... You, you know what else is you know crazy what though? Like, and I, I don't even like mean to throw a shot, but like how your family came to see you on death's bed. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And the news is saying that they made them sign NDAs and no phones and none of that to be oh, in yeah. there with father, uncle, cousin. You know, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, I just found that kind of strange because Wait, sometimes you said they they made them sign NDAs. Yeah, yeah, wow, yeah, yeah, wow. And I think, well, I think me and you was having this conversation before, and um, oh, me, yeah, talking about relevancy of like OJ, like yeah. I didn't even realize this man was in jail for 10 years, bro. 13, I think. Like, for that's crazy. For stealing his own stuff. For stealing his, for own, stealing his own stuff. Yeah. Yo, I remember, because um, my house was not, was right next to USC. USC is like a few blocks away from my house where I grew up in Cali. Mm-hmm. And at USC, before all of this happened, they have a whole room dedicated to him. His Heisman and everything is in the middle of the room. You walk in, it's dark, and it has, you know, lights and pictures and trophies and shit in there. Right when that shit happened, like, the next week, they got rid of that. Got rid of that shit. You know? And he was like, you know, can't front. He was one of the first ones with all the endorsements. He was like, he was like, he was like White America's prize at that time. Those Hertz commercials and all of that. You know, it's crazy. They do that shit to all of us, bro. Mm -hmm. They put us on a a pedestal. Mm -hmm. So high, mm-hmm. and then the first chance they get, you mm-hmm. know, it's like the clown where you throw the the ball at and right. try to knock them off. Yeah, that's what they do because yeah. Yeah. the same thing they did to him, they doing to Diddy. Mm-hmm. And it's funny how it come around. You see what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So it's a but vicious. I will say this too, though. 
in the last like eight months to a year, I really got to know OJ because of <laughs> Cameron and Mace. Oh, okay. You know what I'm I saying? Did. The um, it is what it is. I thought you were talking on a personal level. Nah, nah, nah. And what? he was like, not funny on that show. I got to know him on that show, and he he loosened up. Like Cameron yeah. even told a story yesterday. He was talking about how um. OJ when he first got on the show he kept saying y'all they, they, they use the n-word too much they keep saying nigga this nigga that they they using the n-word too much and then by like the 8th or ninth episode yeah. that's when OJ was like you know I got my little nigga zoo too like he started <laughs> right. so just the way he opened up nah, like I got dope. to know him on a different level because of the show he was funny he knew knew what he was, nah, knew his shit on funny football so he was you know nah, he, shit, even yeah. little interviews that little clips that they show of him you could see like the human aspect and yeah. personality yeah. of him. Yeah. yeah. Like, I, I ain't get to know him or experience him pause yeah. personally. Yeah, yeah. But, uh, you know, he seemed like a dope individual. Yeah. So much so much to that. Going too stuff. soon. So, yeah. as they all say, soon. going too soon. But wasn't yeah, he no like 70 something? No matter what you might think of him, he is, he's definitely How old was he? 72. Uh, 72? How old was he? Yeah, 72 or something. He was like 72, 76 yeah. or something like that. Something like that, like in his seventies or whatever. I'm going to say early to mid seventy six. Seventy seven. So, but the, the the ill thing is, see how fast things happen. Though he was on Cameron and May show. I, I checked it yesterday. The last time was February something. Mm. That was like a month and a half ago. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And he was fine, seemed like. Right. And then but even when he was on it, I ain't gonna front though. I could tell, like you know. I could just had that he look. Was dying from nothing. Nah, he's he had an old man. Because he said he had stuff that he was he was yeah. little health issues. I I kind of could. I, but he didn't look I, like I he got was the next. Feeling. He was gonna die in a month. He didn't not look not like in a that. month, but I kind of got the feeling like, like you know what I'm saying. It, you know, still, it was surprising. Like, I, he looked old to me, but he but he's 76 years old. He's supposed to look old, mm-hmm. right? Um, yeah, I mean, it, shit. It, he was talking about like he a couple of times he went to like 76. Talking about a couple of times he went to see a doctor and he got like. You know, he said, no, nah, it's just something I'm taking care of with my health. But, and he was drinking his blueberry juice. It's just that, that look. He had that look for me. He had yeah, that look. Yeah, like, yeah. you know. I, I couldn't tell personally. He just looked sure. as old as he was. I mean, he wait. looked good for that age, like he said. Wait I just couldn't second, tell. Wait a second. Because now I feel a type of way. You said he was drinking his blueberry juice. Mm-hmm. So this last week, I've been drinking a blueberry juice. Mm-hmm. In the morning, first thing in the morning. So do I got the look? That's, that's what I'm saying. I'm, nah, I'm I didn't say he was drinking the blueberry juice and that caused him to look that way. No, I'm just... He was drinking the blueberry juice because whatever he was dealing with, oh, you know, okay. he was trying to get on that health care. trying to get on that health care. A lot of people passing. Speaking yeah. of passing, yeah, we got recipes to OJ. Rest and also OJ. DJ, Peace to OJ. Mr. C. Mm. Mr. C. That was a big one. That was a big one, I think, for the hip hop community. Yeah. Ask me why I don't know. I think it was because he um, he introduced Biggie. Like he introduced, I mean, he Biggie. introduced a lot of people. Yeah. Biggie alone to me, just passing that demo tape along. You've done enough, sir. You've done mm. enough. Mm. Yeah. yeah. Like just the Biggie. Just well, Big Hot Daddy Kane DJ. DJ for forever. Shout out to Hot ninety seven. What was it? The Back finisher. When it was Hot ninety seven. Who was he? The finisher. Nah, Mr. C. DJ Mr. C. Nah, yeah, finisher. I think they call yeah, the finisher. finisher. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 And then um, I saw um, Ebro and all of them do, giving them tri- tri- um, tributes. I can't speak to them. Giving them tributes and everything, talking about like the kind of dude he was. Yeah, they were really hurt. Saying? They was they was giving it up, giving they up was, love to him. I'm not saying um, they was hurt, but they was trying to give him his light and his his yeah, uh yeah his flowers. Paying him that homage. You know, his yeah, his legacy is kind of tainted. Sort of because of the accusations of the trans and all of this stuff, um, but what well, he opened up to it after yeah, a while. Say, yeah. You know what's crazy? Well, I can't that? say he stepped out and was like, "Fuck it." Yeah. I ain't gonna even lie. Like I could see, I, I'm not saying I could see him getting involved in that, but I could see how like a rumor like that could actually spread. Right. And I'm gonna just use me for an example, mm. right? So when I was young, clubbing, da da da, with mm. with a couple of homies. Like we used to go downtown to the to the clubs and all that, but downtown, 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 downtown. But sometimes the clubs had different nights. Right. So one spot, <laughs> one time we went to a spot, <laughs> and it was you know it was a different night, right. but we didn't know. Right. Yeah. So we get there, and I can see how it's only like yo these niggas is wild. Yeah, yeah, we yeah, see yeah, them yeah. in the spot. Nah, yeah, yeah. it really. If it was camera phones, it was stuck. Yeah, <laughs> it really was a mistake yeah, because we corrected it and went back. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. 
I'm not saying that he did he did do it. I'm not saying that he didn't do it because yeah. he came out and said whatever he said. Yeah. I think he did it. He's, well, he, you know. But, you know, yeah, shit, yeah. niggas fuck up. Yeah. I'm not saying that don't don't make it seem I'm not saying that nah, like nah, I'm nah. fucking up and yeah. I'm intentionally going out there looking and like yeah, yeah, yeah I'm yeah. fucking up. No. Yeah, I we we I did that before too. Just make um, mistakes. We went out, you know, we used to hit the clubs in, in LA and Hollywood and shit like that. And this is one club called Peanuts. Everybody know the club. Mm. Um and so we ended up we, we did we did to a went which I can't talk today. We went to a few different clubs that night and we ended up at Peanuts. Now, t- that night happened to be... Now, we didn't know this, but later on, we know that it's a gay club. But that night was lesbian night. It was actually... Lucked out. It was actually... <laughs> yeah, it could have yeah, been the other way. Actually, actually lucked right? out. You know what I'm saying? My shit was the other way. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. We were looking around like, word? <laughs> what was the club in Manhattan where all the... Um, back in the day, day, that they used to talk about? The tunnel? No, no. Lennox Lounge? No, no, no. It's just like a real disco y club. Like we talking about like sixties, seventies. Something fifty one, oh, um, Area Fifty One. Studio fifty four. The, there you go. Yeah, that yeah, shit. Yeah. It was like that. Yeah, yeah. Studio fifty four. So, wow. That was even before. That's from what that I heard. That's the yeah. time before the time. That's my mama and them. Uh, yeah, yeah. Telling mm, me like, yeah. I remember we back in the day we used to go there. We yeah, used to yeah, yeah. Do some yeah. wild shit. But yeah, peace out to him. Um, Condolences to him and his family. DJ Mr. C, thank you for Notorious B.I.G. Shout out to everyone he discovered. You know what I mean? You know. Especially Notorious B.I.G. Produces first demo tape. Yeah, that's a big Mm. fact. That's big. Mm. (laughs) No pun intended, but that's big. That's a big fact. Yeah. Yeah, Those is big facking tens. Cultural DJ Mr. C. There's a big I don't know if I remember him on High 97. Maybe, yeah. maybe I do. I probably gotta go back and nah, listen to like the old replays there. or whatever. Nah, see, was when it's when you it's on that when they had the hip hop nights on Fridays and Saturday nights. Yeah. The Friday the mixes yeah. you had to catch them on. Yeah, you I don't even saying? remember none of the old formats. Like, oh yeah, no, all no. I remember is like Battle of the Beats. Yeah, because um, mm-hmm. that's really for it. a long time hip hop was only like late night, late late night, yeah, and yeah. then Fridays and Saturdays when you catch Flex and C, Mr. C, and all of them. Get Go your flex. tapes ready. Yeah, Go yeah, flex. you make some tapes. Off that's when shit. you had to press record and play yeah, at the same time you for you young people who don't the week. Yeah. who don't got voice record now. We have to get blank tapes, right? Mm-hmm. Pause, put in the radio, have it mm-hmm. ready, have it ready, plus play and record mm-hmm. to record over. Mm-hmm. And get just you that 90 make you a tape. nice little mix. Or I take tape. my pops tapes or something Man. and put the little the little cover over the open spot. Over the over spot to record over them. Over his yeah, shit until we figured that out. Yeah, that was <laughs> crazy. Go reach for his tape and mm-hmm. I got my mixes on this shit. That's that was you, that was our version of hacks and all that. <laughs> that's yeah. for the two thousand babies who yeah, yeah, baby. they don't really on, know man. about that. That was so. I A I. Come on, man. We did whatever we had to do to get to that hip hop. We did what we had to do to get that hip hop. But yeah, man, hip hop. Yeah. Speaking of hip hop, we right. got J. Cole fires. First of all, let's talk about what I was gonna say Wait. before he apologized. I want I wanna I wanna interrupt you. I wanna shout you out right here today, bro. And I'm I'm only giving you a shout out. Because you keeping us on track. Like, I like how you throwing the segues. <laughs> right, right. I like what you, you know, doing know, today. He calling the play. I, listen. You know, calling the play. Listen, the man. Shout out to oh, Wise oh, Mark oh, oh. right here, He man. calling the plays. You know? Shout out to that, man. Uh-huh. All right, let's keep the show rolling. Coach Where we going? Play, we going to run it. But yeah, you know, J. Cole, I was going to talk about that what is it? Crocodile Tears? I think he dropped a bunch tears. of songs. Crocodile and tears he was the going in Crocodile Tears that was dope. Fire. He was going in You had him song on it. You had the The knife to his tears, neck bro. Yeah And then he said I'm sorry Yeah, yeah I don't want to fight no more I'm sorry I don't want yeah, to that? fight Nah I, 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 I J. Cole I don't want to fight I don't know I don't, I don't know I don't, I, know I don't I think like. Yeah it's kind of It's kind of mixed But mm. I see In him apologizing Why he apologized because bitch assness Kendrick verse mm-hmm. wasn't even really about him. Yeah, yeah. So he took it a little too, too personal. Yeah, yeah. You know what I mean? And it, I get where he was going, but Kendrick verse was about him. Not to mm, interrupt you. No, not just not, to cut you off. It was like two. Bars. It was Kendrick, like two bars, bro. He said not the. He it was said like mother two, F a big three. It's just, it's big, just big. Okay, that's one. That was that. Was that. That's that was one. It? Negro bum. That was it. 
That's all he, he said. He said Prince li- outlived Mike Jack, nigga. Bum. First of one, all, one, two, three. Why did he feel like he had to respond? Wait, but question. wait, no, we going we gonna go the way he's going. Right. He said the King whole Kendrick. song was about him. I didn't he say the said, whole song. You said it I was said about he J. Was going Cole. at J. Nah. Cole. He's Bro, definitely three going bars at him. Is, is but letting you know, the whole, nigga. Like the whole rest of the verse was towards him. This disrespect towards you. He made a whole track <laughs> <laughs> about nah, that's what it Kendrick, is. Nah. bro. He made a whole track about Kendrick. Who? J. Cole. Yeah. Okay, so what? He made a whole track. You did too much. First it, of all, it was too Kendrick much made, before we even get to the apology. It was too much too soon. I could have threw much. the same amount of shots back at you. Right. Three, four, five balls. Cole right. was winning. I threw a whole 16 at Cole you. Cole was right. winning. Point was, blank. At that point, with them songs he was dropping, he, that put him in the lead right there. No, it didn't. Yes, it did. What? No, that verse? That I mean, verse, I, the cold. That, the I'm talking about the cold. Response. Crocodile Tears. What he said? Um, he said your whole but the clique whole project getting slid on. Him, you a mouse pad? Yeah, whole, that was that was cold. The whole project yeah, wasn't was about. But he was talking Kendrick, about. Though. He was talking about uh, on that line. He was talking about um, future. We don't know that though. Yeah, so you don't know. I, That's why I don't. I don't know that. I think he was talking song. about Kendrick. I mean, yeah, I think I it know. was whack that he apologized. And the reason I say that is because a lot of people are saying like he's even, been labeling himself as one of the elite. But Rhyme even before we get time. to that, even before we get to that, y'all think y'all, y'all, y'all think Kendrick was in the lead in that in that yeah, he's battle. Still in the lead. Yeah, I don't think he was in the lead yeah, after yeah, J Cole I, dropped all of those. No, no, after matter. J Cole dropped that it leveled the playing field. After J Cole dropped Seven Minute Drill, J Cole was up. It's not just seven minutes. Drill. It's not just seven minutes. I disagree no, with that. No, no, that no, no, was a weak we diss song, yo. And, and it was so weak nah, that nobody seven believed Seven minutes drill was a little different. Nah, that was weak. That was weak. And you could tell he didn't even want to, he didn't even want to rap. He didn't even want to say the stuff he was saying. And the stuff he was saying, he knew he was lying. You talk about this dude's albums. Yo, my nigga, you can say a lot about Kendrick, but you can't talk about the quality but of his albums. But you biased, though. None of them. You biased. None of them. You biased. No. You're biased. I am. But All right still, then. but still, I'm still looking. <laughs> You're I'm still looking at the. I'm still looking at the facts, though. We talking about the facts here. J. Cole cannot talk about Kendrick's discography at you all. Can, yeah, I agree. At I all. definitely agree with Man, that. No. At all. I, I mean, definitely and agree even with to that. a lot of points, Drake, but Drake we can't talking, even talk about a discography. You ain't got no damn. But if we talk about a, commercially successful, a good kid, Matt City, you ain't got a, a pimp of Kendrick ain't up there. Of, well, Cole's not up there with Kendrick either. But no, I was gonna say Kendrick ain't up there with, with Drake. As far as nah. commercially successful selling albums, but when it come to good albums, nah, well, nah, Drake, Drake, Drake good kills albums them with too, the numbers, but the numbers lie. Niggas say numbers don't lie. Numbers this lie. Is, they, they, they do. Numbers lie. When Streaming we have farms and all that. Yeah, yeah that's true. When, they do. But, but numbers lie. Popular is one thing. Yes, he's the most popular. But the better artists? No, that's neither one of them. I Who's think the Cole popular? took the lead no, off this. Drake, by oh, yeah, yeah. Drake is, the, is definitely he, most popular. He got out them by yeah, hundred yeah. and something million talking about yeah, albums. Yeah, yeah, but yeah, I think right. Drake. I, I think Cole was taking the lead. He was he was on pace to take the lead in this battle. No, it in was this just what had he said. not apologized. It was just what he said. Thank you. Had he. Had you know, he not apologized? He was. That's nah. a thank you. No, no, no. Yes, that, he was. That, he had to apologize because he, he know that was whack, Kid. yo. Had he not he, apologized? He knew that was whack. Had he not yo. apologized, bro? Nah, nah, nah. He was yo. not taking none away from Kendrick. <laughs> nah, dog. That seven minute drill Drake was, was whack, up. yo. And he knew that wasn't enough. Did See, you just, listen to old cold shit? It, yeah. It's just no. I listened to Crocodile seven, Tears seven and I, Seven Minute Crocodile Drill. Crocodile Tears was the one that people should have been talking about. Crocodile Tears. That's what I'm. That that's, one that's, was the one. Right. Everybody got stuck His with Seven Minute Drill. It, like and Seven Minute Drill was whack. Crocodile Tears. Whack. Is Crocodile fire. Tears is the one. Who, 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 I who, said you should have did this one. Who do you think has a better flow, Kendrick or or or, or Cole? Kendrick got like a hundred flows. Right, I'm about to say you can't compare that. Yeah, Kendrick got a hundred flows. During yeah. these times. I must say Cole stepped his flow up. Yeah, but his lyrical stepped- ability. He was pacing on until nah, dog. like like my man it's, said. It's no universe. Until that apology. It's no universe with, with yeah, Cole's apology. With the apology. Are you serious yeah, in the I battle? I don't know. What, not, I don't even know what you know what um, I don't like. I don't know what the internet even talking about. Kendrick um, Cole was never fucking with Kendrick on no lyrical shit. Never ever. The, in the, a battle the, the is thing different. about those three is that they all different. 
Mm-hmm. And they all have their own strengths and weaknesses. Huh. That's what's dope that's, about that's, them. That's, that's battle. And that's what makes it hard to kind of I don't want to compare them. excuses. Nah. Come in, on. In, 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 a, that's in, a, in a battle, we got <laughs> this MC <laughs> against <laughs> that Can MC. you see what he's trying to do today? That's all I'm he saying. Fine, I'm, I'm keeping it real. So, so yeah, yeah. He playing devil's advocate today. MC against that MC in a battle. They discography don't really matter at that point. Yeah, period. Yeah, but but but, but yeah, what I've heard from him and what I've heard from opinion, him is Jay-Z, gonna trickle into my In my, my opinion, Jay Z beat Nas. But no. everybody says okay. Nas beat Jay Z. I think Jay Z is lyrically better than Nas overall. But I have to admit, in that We're talking about the battle. That's all I'm saying. Why would you Why would you say Jay Z beat Nas? Though? I think well, I think Takeover is better than Ether. I don't care what nobody say. Take My over. opinion, See, you're, you're wrong. wrong. I no, think no, Takeover you're, is you're, better you're, than Ether. You're Jay, historically you think wrong. He went at more people on it. You're historically wrong. I don't. I I, I could be that. And your opinion, and I'm wrong. standing on that. <laughs> your opinion, I'm, I'm standing on it. But it's it's still my opinion to have. And I feel like. Yep. What, was what, I, what was I saying? Jay Z. Yeah. What was you saying? Beat Nas in I mean, that battle. Can we play something from I both feel like what's snippets the name was from, from Takeover and Ether and compare? Are we allowed to do something like we that? We could, but we would have to block out the block that. Ooh. We have to mute it out, like how Ooh. Joe Budden's gonna be doing. Mm. Can we recite the rhymes? Yeah, we could recite the rhymes mm. and all that. So go ahead, spit your could Takeover definitely recite bars. recite the rhymes unless we was going live. Mm. Mm, nah, mm, 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 Come on, the whole just ten years. The fuck, Jay Z. Come on, it done. J Cole oh, got his structure from the full album in ten years. Yeah, yeah, that's what made his shit whack. You think so? Biting off of him. Hmm, that that's, that's interesting. He's that's supposed everybody to be, he's supposed off to be cold. Everybody. He didn't have to bite that line. Everybody biting off nah, everybody. Nah, but that was, for for Cole, as good as he is, that was um lazy. Y'all consider that biting off? That was lazy, yeah. Because he, he didn't just take a line. He took like a whole he took four bars. He, he took, took the, the scheme. Format. Yeah. And it, whole, that, that was whack. Format. That was whack. That's, that's part nah, of the reason okay, why. Nah, and then, nah. And then he didn't even deliver it right. You think that was whack too? What the way he Cozy? did that? Nah, I thought it was. He didn't even. I didn't. I mean, it in a I nice caught way. it. I caught it in a moment. I'm like, Ho said these the yeah. same thing. We, but you, we automatically going to know if you're a hip hop head. You going to know, know that. it. That was whack. You going to know it? The 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 average casual fan nowadays yeah. ain't going to really know that. And it wasn't believable. And he sounded. You know nah, what? It wasn't he believable. Sound, he sounded. Yeah. He sounded like he was chilling on no, that no. track. He sounded like. He didn't really believe the words he was saying. Nah, that's what he sounded like. What are you Somebody dissing. He wants some attention. <laughs> Come yeah. on, I My like dog, that like, flow. Say the word. He was halfway in it. He on bullshit. Nah, that shit was you iffy. wild. That shit was bro, iffy. That shit he's was, better than that. That, shit that was didn't fire. That bro. didn't even match up to all the features he's been doing for the last three years. That shit was. That bro, shit was seven mid. What did you? Was what did you want? Like he should have never. He should have never did that. Uh, you wanted like a hit him up or something? That wasn't. He could have did anything better than that. Hit him up nah. was trash. He did anything better than yeah, that. hit him up. I'm not gonna say it was trash. I'm gonna say Pac needed help. Hit him. Hit him up wasn't no trash. It wasn't trash. It, it wasn't trash. That's it was okay. Bias. That's yeah. bias. Now, now, it was now okay. We, now we out here just saying anything. <laughs> nah, it was, it was okay. <laughs> what are we talking? about? Because he needed help. Pac needed <laughs> what help what on hit him up. We talking right. about? We hit him up. If you think trash. about it, on hit him up, he only he had like four other MCs to go at. He was killing to go at big. He was killing the whole to go at. That big. That's good. To go at you big. Know what, you, you know what know? Cole should have did? You know what Cole should have did? Mm. He should have pulled J.I.D. up. Now, it J. took I. four niggas J. to I. shoot. got a better chance of going at Kendrick than he do. But I see what you're saying on a lyrical uh, acrobat. I, I was like, there was so many levels he could have played this, dog. He could have... J.I.D. is nasty with yeah, him. Yo, yeah. Yo, nasty. Yeah. He could have sent this young boy at him. You know what I'm saying? I but, mean, so... He could have played this a lot of ways instead of that. that so little back to the old scope of it. Did. J Cole was winning. Was winning. No, he took the lead. Nobody, right there. nobody. Listen, this is a two one vote, that's right? Your, J Cole. Cole. Okay, we okay. So let, 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 let me let me just, just say this. Let me just say my winning, piece, and then I, and then I shut up on it. But he straight lost after the no, apology. No, 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 no. Bro. That's what I was. It was one zero when that shit was out. No, it was not. It was one zero with those tracks that Cole just released. He it went was ahead. One, he it went was, ahead. It was nah. three one right there. No. Yes, it was. Nah, it with all the tracks, yeah. three one. <laughs> you know what it is? Y'all both biased. Y'all, y'all not I'm listening. Not no. I listen for listening. lyrics. I listen for flow. Yeah. I listen for content. Yeah, yeah, yeah. we listen for. Y'all not listening for that. I'm a J. Y'all not listening for that. I'm wow. telling you, I'm a Kendrick I'm fan, guy. just like you're a Kendrick fan. Yeah, yeah, but that don't but mean that don't mean I'm not objective though. I'm objective. I'm an MC. I'm a Jedi. 
I'm a Jedi mm. too. And I I'm mean, an analyst of this thing. I, okay. You know what I'm saying? So I'm listening to all those things. And if he would have if that would have been the case, if that seven minute drill was that shit, I say it was that shit. The I'm shit not saying whack, it was yeah. that shit. The shit was whack. And it was he should be embarrassed for even putting that out. And I ain't that's saying why, it was whack. And that's why he said, Look, what did he say in his apology? My man's there was like what you gonna yeah, do. Yeah, let's get Cole? to the apology, right? What you gonna do, Cole? He said, after listening to it back. And listening to and reading the responses, I have to say that was the wackest shit I ever did. What was your reaction? This is what he said. So what was your reactions it. when you I got to see these first heard responses. about the you apology? Gotta believe, you got to believe what he said. What was my what response? Was, what was your reaction when you first heard the apology? I, my stomach started hurting. Yeah, I was sad. Yeah, that shit was. It was yeah, I was disappointed. I was, I was disappointed. Not sad. But wait, why you was sad? Because if you didn't think he was winning, why would you nah, be but sad? Still fight, man. Fight, dog. This is what we do, yo. This is hip hop, dog. I was, I was. I don't care. Even if you lose, and throw your punches, dog. Throw your punches. Man, you know what I'm I saying? I felt disgusted. Like you didn't even get into the fight yet, and then you just threw in a towel. Yeah. Listen, I'm just like, saying right now. At this point, he can't even be. He should not want to label him, himself as one of the elite MCs right now. And that's sad because he is. He still is actually. But yeah. and and that was the but thing that a, a lot of people were saying. It's like, yo, who who we talking about here? J. Cole. J. Cole. Okay, okay. There was a lot of people saying, like, yo, his last albums, he was claiming, he was paving his way to claim the fame. You yeah. see what I'm saying? Saying, yeah. I'm yeah. top tier, da da da. And the elites really don't apologize, bro. Nah, like no. you said, we fight, we fight, we, we fight, rumble, we, we win rumble. We lose, but we, we fight. Yeah. You and know that's what, what it's about. Did, you did, win did, or lose if you fight. Did Nobody did cares apologize? if you lose, but if you, st- if you give apologize. up. So they don't apologize to Nas? Didn't his moms make him come on the radio and apologize? That was no, years, that was years later. later. That after they was that grown was men. That was years That's later. Different. That's different. He That's didn't different. apologize. That's years just later. mature men. Bro, that was yeah. years. He went on the radio later. the next day. He put no, down the song no, "Super no, Ugly." No, no, no. no, no, no. He, there's a story about that when he talked about the um the condom in the seat and all of that Man. that his moms told him like chill yeah that's oh, what he was talking about to his moms about that. Oh, he didn't apologize. Okay, my bad. I retract that statement. No, you know, um, I retract it. But yeah, you you go off scrapping, my dude, and he too good to do that, yo. And all Who's of this too talk, good? Cole, J- Cole, okay. Cole. okay, all this talking the last year, two years, three years, yo. These niggas talking like out it. they neck, right? <laughs> That's what Cole was doing. Right, right. He was talking out his neck. Yeah, I don't know. He could have played this. He could have played it a whole bunch of different ways. Now. On one hand, I give it up to him for being a man and saying this don't fit with me. You know, this don't fit my spirit. But you um, so though. I can respect that. But though. then don't rap then. Or don't 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 throw shots at the whole industry. So you telling him to quit. I mean, whatever. I mean, it you know, the, the ironic thing about all of this, and I I almost think this shit could be a fucking rollout. What's his next album called? That's what they were saying too. Well, I forgot. The fall off. The fall off. This could be a setup to that. I what think better it's all setup marketing. would it would it be than this? It's great marketing. It's fantastic. Yeah. All of it is great marketing. Yeah. We talking about yeah. them. It's fantastic. Yeah. I, I'm feeling like in the, in the back of my mind, I'm like, this is a setup. Even this whole album, this whole shit, this whole project, yeah. I might delete later. That's Are you just really a, that's just a throw out before a, his album. Yeah, yeah. But yeah. this, the whole industry against Drake, this could be all a rollout. Yeah. They could all be working together. I think so because the industry had to be restructured versus how it was. Back in the '90s, with this the new format Imagine of everything. Imagine if this is a rollout. This is going to be the greatest rollout ever because he him have doing to deliver, that though. and everybody think he fell Got off deliver. to lead up into the fall off, where mm-hmm. all of them now are on that album, would be crazy. I that just, ain't going to happen. I don't That's know. Not happen. That ain't going to happen. I thought about this. I'm telling you, why that would he? Gonna... Why would he stand next to Drake? You know why it ain't going to happen? Because Drake got a track, this and Cole. Nah. But all of that could be part of it. This whole beef. Could yeah, that could be part. Yeah, I, I, it'll. Could I think be, the beef shit, even like, with the between the female rappers, all of this is. It could just be like which one? Somewhat planned. Yeah. The scripted reality show. Yeah, this you know whole beef saying? could be part. I'm just th- thinking on so, parallel universes. Okay. This whole beef could be part of because why would Drake? I mean, why would he even stand next to Drake? Now he knows Kendrick. Known Kendrick for years. They came out together. They they was best friends. They did songs together. They almost had an album together. Him and him and Cole are, are like this. We all know that. So Cole goes stands next to Drake, right? Why is he standing next to Drake? Then they do a song kind of hinting about, oh, that's planned, about yeah. your man. Cole, that would be a real funny position for Cole to be in publicly like up. that. 
if that wasn't on purpose. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Yeah, I think or so. am I standing next to this nigga so that so that you can sh- so I make it easier for you to shoot at him setting Drake up? I don't know. Mm. And that's I why I'm, I just, think, I'm just I'm just freestyling. That's, that's why I think Drake came shit, out with right? that. Just freestyling, yeah. but this it seems like something's behind. Something all of is this, cooking yo. in the pot. Yeah. That's why Drake got that Drake response and. What's this? What's this guy named DJ Academics is doing? He did an interview on um, with Vlad where they just basically talking about Drake. Yeah, I think that, I think all that's a part of the marketing. Yeah, it, this could, could all be. be a rollout, yo. Uh, it's just interesting to see where it's gonna go. You didn't hear the Drake be. response song? Nah, man. I haven't heard it. That shit is dope. I haven't heard it. Maybe we should well, yo, play so that. What are we, it's dope. Uh oh. <laughs> Yeah, I think it's garbage too. Yo. You think oh, it's garbage? He yeah. sound like uh, he sound. I mean, like, apart from the stuff, he, he like got the ass. Jedi saying that shit garbage. Yo, he sound like a, a mad little girl. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> That's what he sound like on that. The flow on it is sure cool. You don't even wear size seven shoes. So it's, it's a good song. <laughs> it's, it's, it's not enough. These niggas though. talking out their neck. Let me take yo. back. Let me, let me take right. back my dope. It's, it's, it's okay. Up. These niggas clicking up. <laughs> it's just not enough. I told Top to give me fifty. <laughs> yo, y'all got to do better than that. Yo. No, but I think I, gotta, I, I think this is how they do the rollouts now. Like they'll they'll get it to people like DJ Act. They'll be like, yo, act like it was leaked. We was talking about this earlier. Yeah. They'd be like, act like it was leaked. Play it. Test the audience. See if they like it or not. And then if they like it, it's mine. If Drake they did don't, that. I did it's that. If AI. they don't, he gonna act it's like AI. it was some, yeah, some AI shit. This shit sound whack as fuck though. Sonically, I think it sounds good. Sonically, for just being a song, I think it sounds good. Now, as far as the, I need, I need you to hear that. He's yeah, I got it. I, yeah, we, we gonna we gonna, we gonna let him hear. hear it. He's in I, I didn't hear we it. We gonna yet, let him hear. We so. might we might break, let him listen to it because it's only gonna take about three minutes, and I could just re-edit that back in. Do you think he's talking yeah. out of their neck? But um, but yeah, this oh, is so gonna, be, gonna pull it up. Right. Not, not right now, but but it, it's gonna be real interesting to see where it uh, where this shit go. But I I do got a sneaky feeling that this is probably scripted. But one thing I will say though, if um <laughs> all these niggas teaming up on Drake and trying to jump him like this, it's only making Drake look better. Nigga doing something, <laughs> yeah, right? I, I cannot front. He doing like, something, yeah. Right? He I, I can't top dog. None of y'all all y'all niggas tried to do From their features with him all these years. Y'all did music with him all these years to get y'all numbers up. And now all of a sudden we don't trust you, we don't like you. No, that's how it is like in real life and, but it just yeah. it just it's, it's too um they didn't even fake it it's Man, just like you just hate us they probably they, actually saying like the beef really come down to Drake and Metro Boomin right what I don't right. know right well, I'm just now right. Metro Boomin got projects and, and I saw some TikTok short or mm-hmm. something like that where they were saying Metro Boomin got this track. Drake got this track. You see what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah. Like with I'm the like, same name. Oh, same or uh, see what's the similar name? Similar names or the Word. opposite name? So Yo, like, see that's wow. what I'm saying. This is a rollout, dog. Yeah, yeah. I definitely think so. Because they have to find new ways of marketing, this and is this a is a part of it. I, 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 you want to make go, it seem authentic. Yeah, yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Just so you keep release that in it on the back of your mind, audience. When y'all start hearing things, roll just out. think about it. Might be just a rollout. Roll but this, out. if it executed right, this is gonna be the greatest rollout. Roll out. If we get some good music from it, I think any type of beef that we see nowadays, especially in hip hop, when it came to the, the women rappers, all that, I think it's all gonna be a part of a rollout, or it's all part of, as you say, a rollout or marketing to get more eyes on them. Well, mm. well, that's different. Some sometimes people don't like other people. And that's just what it is. Cardi, Cardi and Nicki is, is real beef. They actually got into a little scrap before. You know what mm-hmm. I'm saying? Where somebody threw a shoe and cut cut, cut Cardi's face. It could be some realness too. So just, some, just like with the but, with the dudes, it's probably yeah. real realness. But I but, think, but but they're, they're gonna use it. But sometimes, like when it's staged like this, when it's out the blue and orchestrated with a bunch of people involved, that's a different kind of rollout. You know what and I'm saying? They, they was doing something else where they was matching songs, like they got matching songs and all that. Yeah. The songs answering each other. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The t- song titles or whatever answering each other. So what yeah. Say? It was like Cinderella shoes or something shoes. And mm-hmm. Yeah. Somebody got to think called Every Cinderella. One of the songs yeah. I'm are like, just like oh, the opposite wait. of what. And what they said in that piece is that whole idea came from iCarly. iCarly was a show for kids yeah, back yeah, in the day. Yeah, yeah. In that in that um sitcom or whatever. There was two groups battling, and one group was the hot group, 
the other group took every song that they did and and made the opposite of it. Mm. And what it did in, in the end, it drove both of their group's numbers up. Gotcha. So that's what happened in that little show. But they saying all of this is based off of some shit like that. Anyway. Yeah, I think it, I think definitely based off marketing roll is definitely yeah. a marketing rollout, as you say. Right, well, anyway, we taking our first break so we so I can hear this song, man. Word up. Okay. 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 Wait. 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 That was good. It was better than I thought the first couple times I listened to it. Um, but it ain't gonna be enough. But it's the first blow, so I'm gonna give him that. Cameras back on. Are we back? Oh. I think we back. I think we back, we back, we ready, we ready, we ready. We got a chance to sample the song. Well, I got a chance to sample nah, the song. Nah, I got a chance to listen to it clear now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, and I always knew it was dope. I'm standing with Wise Man. Nah. My man Wise Mark over nah, here. I'm going to say dope. It was cool. It was, it was, it, it, it was pretty dope. Bro. It, was, it, was, it, was, it was some real... Hook strong. It was. Some, it was it some, wasn't no jabs. It was hooks. Nah, Body shots. Some shots. You know what I'm saying? Some shots thrown. Any, so, um, any group that up. Nah. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. I don't want to stop. On and that, he yo. addressed. Yep. Everybody. Yeah. Yeah. I can't front. Kendrick. He addressed them. Mm-hmm. J Cole definitely mm-hmm. addressed them. Metro. Metro mm-hmm. definitely addressed them. Mm-hmm. Weekend. Weekend addressed them. Uh-huh. Future addressed uh-huh. them. ASAP Rocky. ASAP too. <laughs> yeah. Everyone who threw a shot. Yeah. Do it back. Do it back. And see, now Pause. he's in a position Word. to win. So if this is an actual track mm. that he put out. And that he wrote all of. Even mm. if he didn't write all of it, it sounds cohesive nah, enough. write it, though, get the fuck out. We'll never find out, though. Yeah, we, we might. But if we do. We might. We don't find do. out on this one. There's but, always that um, asterisk there, but. But let's, let's, talk, let's think about, what, let's talk about dope, what's dope. in front of us, though. What's in front of us? This is a. I actually getting to hear it like clear now and not from um Axe uh live broadcast. Mm. What? I could hear it better now. And uh yeah, it was it was all right. It in was the in the dope. state I wanna say this though. Drake made a whole song. Mm-hmm. Kendrick did a verse. That's how scared they are. So yeah. if now you really gotta mm-hmm. see what song Kendrick puts right. out. Right. If you're gonna put out a if whole he's song, gonna put a, a whole song, he's gonna keep he, jabbing. He's gonna, he gonna definitely respond to it. So, Kendrick, the ball's in your court, yeah. baby. Yeah, yeah. We need you to come out and show up and yeah. show out. We know you're not apologizing, pause, and we know you coming out. Oh yeah. Nah, nah, Cause that Drake joint right there, that shit is that shit was tough. pretty dope. That shit was alright, man. That nah, that shit was, was pretty nah, dope. Yo, he had all the elements. Front. He had dope lyrics, yeah. double entendres. He had metaphors, punchlines. Uh, and Drake, this, this, is, this, this is a diss track. He had disses yeah. lined yeah. up. Yeah. I yeah. can't front. He didn't. He didn't. He didn't sugarcoat it. He didn't sound like he didn't want to do it like like Cole did. He went straight for niggas next. This is and better. I could, I could appreciate that. Now I'm this, happy now. This song is better than the song that he put out. Way better than Seven Minute Drill. It's way, way better, better than it's way better than Seven Minute Drill, but it's mm-hmm. way better than him and Pusha T because that response was kind of corny. This is better than yeah. This, this is better is, than all of the joints he did so to Pusha T. Even back to now, back he to might me. be. I don't know if it's Battle better than rap seven tested and ready it's way now. better than Seven Minute Drill. I don't know if it's nah, better yeah, than it's Crocodile Tears, Seven Minute Drill. I'm drills. telling you, when Seven I, Minute Drill is just a song. You keep going nah, back I'm to that saying, and Crocodile Tears. I don't care. We, we, sonically, it is, to me, lyrically, excuse me, it's not better than Seven Minute Drill. This, this it's not one? better than Crocodile song? Tears. No, no, lyrically. This, song, this is a real diss song. I'm going to have to listen to it again, but once I once I do, I'm, pr- I'm pretty sure I'm going to feel the same way. I'm a genius. So I'm... I pretty job of building. Yo, this <laughs> this was God. good, man. This was good. I, yeah, you know. it was pretty dope. So yeah, you nah, might want to you song. might want to retract your statement earlier because you were saying what? it was trash. I was, you did. I was, and, and, I, and, and I, said I said it was dope. dope. I, I started off this segment by saying now oh, that okay. I got to hear it clear. Oh, oh yeah, 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 yeah. You did, you did, you, you right. From the live, I got to hear it clear, right. and it's pretty dope. Yeah, uh, hearing it over makes a difference, though. You remember when I heard it early? I was like, oh man, this shit, this shit is. I was cursing, and I was like, this shit is wack as shit, but. I Hearing changed my mind earlier, on that. that this is different. pretty. This is pretty good. This is a pretty good shot for the first round. So Kendrick balls in we, your court, baby. Let's get we're it. Still in the first round. Now the next one, when Kendrick drop, we in the second round. Nah, I think we like at two minutes left in the first quarter right now. Okay, we can do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because it's four quarters. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, we two minutes left. When Kendrick drop, we in the second quarter now. Oh, we yeah. in a hundredth round. Yeah, yeah. Nah, nah. This is um. 
that was pretty good. Now uh, I can hear what he's saying, yo. He was he was shooting some shots, yo. Man. Now he shot better shots at everybody else except for Kendrick. Because all he kept saying about Kendrick is he's short, he's short. midget, and all yeah. of that. That that's cool, but you ain't going you ain't doing nothing to Kendrick. But everybody else though, he kind of served him. Mm-hmm. So <sighs> man. first it was Kendrick jumping them, and now Drake is jumping all of them. <laughs> so I, you got to give it to the dude. Damn, he ain't backing man. down. Yeah, yo, hats off to this you. This is what they're doing. They bringing more attention he, back to hip hop. Yeah, he hats off to you. Rap ready. It's a great battle rap ready right now. Oh, Aubrey I, against the world. I'm not mad at that track. <laughs> it says Aubrey against the world. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that is I am not mad. I'm now. I'm excited again about the whole battle. I was. I was. I was like, this can't be it. We're gonna say it earlier. Yeah, this can't shit. be the track. What I say, what I, what I, my last point on it will be, I think Drake with that song, I can't front, and now that Cole is out, so I can't even count him no more. But with that song, if it ain't no Cole in it, that gives him a little bit of a nudge, but a not, a, not edge, enough for Kendrick. Edge, not edge. enough for Kendrick. I don't Ever care, like, so slightly. Cole against Kendrick, I was more so saying Cole might be doing his thing, but this way, nah, it's, it's, it's gonna nah, be all yo, Kendrick. Yo. Kendrick is known for dope production, dope beats. Dope lyrics, ill lyrics. That's what we gonna see. He, 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 that beat was pretty fire. That beat was super. It, it fire. was a dope joint. It was, it was a dope joint. Fire. I can't front. It was a dope joint. Yo. Hearing it again, I'm and like, wait, okay, it we, just dropped today too. Yeah, yeah they, mm-hmm. people are all rapping oh, yeah. to it right now. Yeah. So it's um, it's pretty dope. When I heard it the other time on on Axe shit, I was I was like ah, oh. but now hearing it clearer is pretty dope. Um, mm-hmm. but it's something to be said about. <laughs> How scared these niggas are, Kendrick. Though all of this started from a fucking few bars. What you talking yeah. about the control a song? Few bars. He didn't even have to do a whole song. Man. Got everybody on choosing sides. The control song, right? Is that what we are talking about? No, from um, uh, from uh, the 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 regular like that. No, I'm out the loop go. with that. Like that. Like that. The the, the shit that he the, did with Metro that started all of this. Man. Oh, the shit he did yeah, with Future. yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, one I verse, got you, I got you. Few lines yeah, and one verse, not even crazy. It's just a few lines. Like eight bars, and they all scared. Everybody picking sides. I mean, Future just said, <laughs> "What you said about Mike Jack and Pretty?" He said, "Oh damn, not Future." I mean, Drake. Drake he said yeah, some yeah. shit. He said some he shit. He said some shit on that. Mike he then, said, ain't Mike now? Some shit yeah, like that. Like, mm-hmm. I'm still a big brother. Yeah, yeah. yeah he yeah, said yeah. some shit. No, he said some shit on that. Now I can hear the words. He said some shit. I ain't gonna front. I'm gonna have to go back and listen to it. This is pretty good. Let's go.